Southwest units, all units, citizen reports, officer needs help, 3742 West Martin Luther King Boulevard. What's good CJ fam? We back with another video. If this is your first time watching our channel, make sure to like this video, hit that subscribe button today, and turn on your post notifications so you're the first to know when we drop a new banger. I'm about to catch a case today CJ fam. I'm about to be calling Jess from jail, telling her she need to come ASAP to come bail me out. So Jessica, she's definitely got me with a couple of pranks that really had me in my feelings, man. She's been getting me heated with her little pranks that she's getting. But don't give her too much credit, man. She ain't be getting me like that. So I know y'all seen I have my jumpsuit on. I couldn't leave the house in a jumpsuit. I told Jess that I'm gonna be going out and going grocery shopping. So she's actually at the crib right now watching Louie for me while I'm out shopping, you know? I got a whole plan though, CJ fam. This how it's gonna go down. I'm a star 67 Jessica on my phone. For y'all that don't know, if you hit star 67 before dialing someone's number, it'll block your number so you show up private. Cause obviously I don't wanna call her, say I'm in jail and it pops up on her caller ID as my number. That would be a fail. So I'm a star 67 Jessica. I'm gonna call her and I'm basically just gonna be letting her know that I'm in the San Diego County Jail and I need her to come with some bail money to get me out ASAP. And I already got a legit little recording on my laptop. I got my laptop right here. It's so legit, y'all. Let me let me play this for y'all real quick one time. This is a call from San Diego County Jail for inmate Calvin Rogers. Press one or say yes if you would like to accept the call. Yes, sir. It's going to be lit, bro. It's so perfect. She's going to be stressing. She really going to think it's the San Diego County Jail calling her. It's going to be a lit video, bro. Make sure y'all give this video a big thumbs up. I actually need to make sure I go ahead and throw my jumpsuit on one time. Hold on, CJ fam. <laughs> hey, I'm looking like a legit inmate. You feel me? Jessica going to be shook. Not only am I going to be calling her, pranking her, telling her I need her to bail me out. But I'm also, I am also finna pull up to the crib, wearing his jumpsuit, banging on the door, talking about, hey, the police coming right now. We gotta go, come on, we gotta get out of town. And I'm gonna see if she really, my Bonnie and Clyde, if she really my rider, and she would be down to go ahead and jump state with me so we don't get caught up by the feds. I'm really interested to see if she would be willing to run away from the police with me. And before I left the crib, I went ahead and set up a camera in the house. So I'm gonna be recording here in, in my car. She think I'm out grocery shopping, but I'm in a car right now. I'm gonna be recording in here, calling her. And then I also got the camera already set up in the crib so that y'all can see her reaction too. Man, it's gonna be a lit video, bro. And if this is your first time watching our channel, Make sure that you go ahead and join the CJ fam, smash that subscribe button, turn your post notifications on so you're the first to know when we come out with a new banger, you feel me? Let's go ahead and get into this prank, CJ fam. Let's go. Star 67. And I, I, gotta, I gotta make sure I have my little clip ready too. You being a good boy? Go CJ fam. I'm about to call it right now. I'm low key nervous. jail right now, babe. Are you serious? Yeah. Babe. Babe, don't play with me. 
No, I'm, I'm dead ass serious, babe. How? Like, how does that, what do you mean you're in jail? Well, I mean, so they gave me, they gave me one phone call, so I just called you. Hey, I'm literally shaking right now. What, like, what happened? Um, uh, it's a long story, but basically, uh, so I was at, I was at the grocery store, and I'm walking down the aisle, and I see some dude, like, looking, looking me up and down, but, you know, I ain't gonna sweat it, so I just keep walking, because, you know, I don't want to start no problems. I'm just there to do my, do my thing and leave, and then... As I'm walking down each aisle, he it seems like he's following me. He keeps giving me dirty looks and everything. And finally, like, I go, I know, I know. I mean, I, I, I was trying my best to, like, keep it cool. Like, I, I walked by, and then I went over into the cereal aisle, and I'm about to grab some cereal. And then, basically, he rides past me and bumps into my cart and then looks me up and down like like what's up like he wants to fight or something but even then like i just take at a deep grocery store at the grocery store he was tripping i don't know what was going on with him and i probably shouldn't be telling you this because the correction officer they probably listened to this which is probably bad for my probably bad for my case i know babe but so like he, even then he, he bumps into my cart and i play it cool like i just take a deep breath and i let it go right and then as I, I got all my items, I head over to the cash register. And as I walk up to the cashier, the same dude jumps right in front of me and cuts me in line and takes my spot. And you know, I couldn't handle it no more. That's the last straw for me. So I basically took the bananas out of my cart and smashed his head with it. And he didn't like that. Yeah, he didn't like- Calvin, what is wrong with you? Are you serious right now? That's really why you're in jail. Well, not just for the bananas. He ended up trying to fight me, so I had to beat it. Calvin, are you serious? You are so much better than that. You're gonna let some little, some little thing happen at the grocery store. Some land, some random man take control over you. Like you, how are you letting some other man control your emotions? Babe, I know, you I know. You are so much better than this. I know, babe. What is with you and now? What do you mean? Like, look where you're at. I know, babe. Like, like, were you even thinking at all when any of this, like, like occurred? Like, did you not think at, like, what was going through your mind? Like, why would you do something like that? I tried. I tried to keep cool, but he kept pressing me, babe. I can't just let him press me like that. I had to do something. Gosh. So what now? Like, what do we do now? Like, I don't... Well, I, wait, I need wait. you, babe, I can't stay in here. I need you to come bail me out. I, you you gotta come down I've, to I've never done this before like I don't know what to do I know it's okay babe you just need to come down go to the bank get some money come down to the San Diego County Jail and bail me out okay I don't even know where the San Diego County Jail is like how am I supposed to like what I don't know what to do like go get money like how much money and like I don't know like who do I call like where do I don't know what to do my my bail is ten thousand dollars Louis like Louis just leave him. He'll, going crazy right now. he'll be fine, babe. He'll be fine. I'm in. I'm in. Why would you put yourself in a position like this? I know, babe. I, I, I messed up. I'm sorry. And now you want me to go to the bank and get money from my savings? And you know that I don't touch my savings because that's for our home. That's for our future. Like, we were supposed to go to our homes and manifest our future. And you're over here in jail, like, over something so stupid. Babe, I know I messed up. That's I'm really sorry. Kind of man that you, are. you know that's not who, who I am, babe. But I messed up. I need you to come bail me out, babe. I don't even know, like, what to do or like how to go about it. Babe, I just go to the bank. Bail is ten thousand, so that means ten percent. You gotta pull out a thousand dollars. Come down to the San Diego County Jail, downtown San Diego, and come bail me out. I gotta go though, babe. I gotta go. The corrections officer is pulling me away. I gotta go. <laughs> CJ fam, I low key feel bad, bro. She's stressed, bro. She's stressed. I'm sorry I had to do it to you, babe, but you know how we do with these pranks, man. I'm going to let her sweat a little bit and I'm going to call her back again. Just making sure that she come with that $1,000, you know what I'm saying? She giving me a hard time, but I can tell she's down to come with that $1,000 to come bail your boy out. I love you, babe. Appreciate you.
but I gotta keep going with this prank and get you. Hey, let's call her back, CJ fam. Let's go. We'll call her back right now. Oh, I gotta make sure. I gotta make sure I have the uh, recording ready. You know, you make it official. All right, CJ fam, we calling her again. I'm about to go run up on her in the house and basically be like, babe, the police coming right now. Let's get it. All right, CJ fam, let's get it. Let's go. Check your boy up. Got the whole, I got the whole little outfit on. Let's go. I'm about to run in there. I'm about to run in there and get her, bro. Babe, babe, open the door. Babe, open the door. Is a 
prank. I got you, man.